something. God took Gabaya. Leviticus 19, 31. I'm deviating. I will come back to the word now. To the word. Leviticus 19, 31. Katukata. Kukupakataka. Regard not them that have familiar spirit. Neither seek after wizard to be defied by them. I am the Lord your God. Give me message. Give me HBS. Do not turn to the mediums or consult spirits or you will be defied by them. I am the Lord your God. Other versions say consulting dead spirits. Now what are familiar spirits? Familiar spirits are spirits that are like monitoring spirits. They follow anybody who is an unbeliever. Hear me well. And all through the journey of that person, they take records of the activity of that person. They are like CID, DSS. They are stationed by Lucifer or Satan, kingdom of darkness. They are assigned. Sometimes three of them can be assigned to one person. So they take record of the person's life. All that happened in that person's life, they keep record of that thing. So they are called, they are familiar. They familiarize themselves with that entity. Now, another thing about familiar spirit. They are familiar with the family history. When an individual is burned from an ancestral worship 400 years ago, a familiar spirit has been assigned to your family. It takes record of all your family history from your great grandfather, fourth generation to you. Now, hear this. If you consult a witch doctor, if the witch doctor prophesy accurately with to you, he carries a familiar spirit that interacts with your familiar spirit that keeps record of all that you have done and can tell you detailedly everything that has happened in your family lineage. Now, for psychists, for those who are necromancer, those who consult the dead, they have quantums of familiar spirit. That is why those who go and invoke the dead, when they say your grandmother has appeared, that's not your grandmother. That is the spirit that was assigned to your grandmother to keep record of all that your grandmother has done. Communicating with the psychist or the necromancer, all the details of all the record he has kept or the spirit has kept and can be 100% right. So that's why God said do not consult the spirits of the dead and there are two types of spirits of the dead there's what I call the spirit that caused death and the spirit of the man that have died even if the Bible was not specific you have to be very careful to know is it the spirit that caused death or the man that have died now hear this. If the Bible said do not consult, that means people are consulting. I will give you an assignment. <laughs> when Moses appeared, was he not dead? Was Jesus consulting the dead? That's an assignment for you. When Moses appeared, was he not dead? 
was dead. So when he was communicating to them, was he consulting the dead? That's an assignment. Another day I will do a Bible study on that. Revelation 19. Let's read 1, 2, 3, 4. I will go back to my message. I want to show you something. That's why you should be very, very careful. He said, and after these things, I heard a great voice. Most people saying, hallelujah, salvation, glory, and honor, and power. Unto the Lord, verse 2. Okay, let's go to 10, verse 10. No, let's look from verse 9 and 10. So that I can now move 9. And he said unto me, right, blessed are they which are called unto the marriage of the supper of the Lamb. And he said unto me, these are the true saying of God. Then look at it, John now. Verse 10. And I fell at his feet to worship him. Because John thought this guy was an angel. And most preachers have said this is an angel. No, he's not an angel. And he said unto me, See thou do it not. I am number one. Thy fellow servant. Meaning, I am like you. And of thy brethren. This is in heaven. John saw a fellow servant, a man of God. Spirit of just men made perfect. That's another teaching. Not just men. The spirit of men who have left, who are righteous, have been perfected. So when they talk, they don't talk anything lies. Okay. He said, I am thy fellow servant. And of thy brethren. I am not an angel. I am a brethren. That have the testimony of Jesus. I was there with the testimony of Jesus. Washed by the blood of the Lamb. So don't think I'm an angel. That's why you should not wash me. For the testimony of Jesus is the spirit of prophecy. Is John consulting the dead? No. It's a dimension. So when you hear men of God said, I saw Elijah in my revelation. I saw Moses of old. It's not consulting the dead. Church is quiet now. Some of you will dream and you see your grandmother or your mother and you start binding it. If your mother died in Christ, that does not mean you are seeing a familiar spirit. You have to draw a line between the spirit of death, familiar spirit. If she died in Christ, that's not a demon. God can use any medium to pass a message across to you. That's a teaching for another day, not for today. Shall we go further? Go to 2 Kings 7 verse 2. Then a Lord on whose hand the king leaned and answered the man of God. And said, behold, if the Lord will make windows of heaven, might these things be. And he said, behold, thou shalt see it with thy eyes, but thou shalt not eat of. Sometime when we prophesy like this. There are people that want to mock the prophet. Anyone that doubts the prophetic declaration I say concerning your life, they will see it, but they will not eat from it. <laughs> say, hey, all this prophet, that's how they do to excite. I'm not exciting you. I speak as an oracle. Your mockers will eat their words. If you shout that amen, something is already happening. Go to verse 3 quickly. Let's rush it. And there were four leprous men at the entering of the gate. And they said to one another, Why sit we here until we we'll die? Da, 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 da. <laughs> Why sit we here? Until we die. It's a risk. Not to take a risk. If you must rise. You must be a risk taker. There is no danger. In taking steps. 
if they want to abuse me let them abuse me but i will exhaust all that i have so that when they ask me did you play your part i will tell them i played my part i had no money when i came here to look at the land the brother who saw this land is no longer here in the church he has finished his assignment don't keep people after they have finished the assignment around you. <laughs> people come into your life for a reason, for a season. You remember? So when they come, know when the assignment has expired. And we came around the land and I walked through the bush. And I heard the Lord say to me, this is the place. Had no money at all. But hear me, I took a step. You don't need to have the money to take steps. Men of faith are men of risk. Four lepers, they were not there when the prophet prophesied, but they can capture in the spirit what was not said. Hear me. There are people hearing the word under the prophet and they are not activated. There are people not present but they are activated. You, you see your problem. You are familiar. Lepers were not around. But if you must follow a prophet, you must be a man of the spirit. The one of the Lord around the king is arguing with the prophet. Four lepers who are outcast. They are not permitted to be part of the city. They were at the, as, uh, 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 the outside part of the city. And they have to live by what people who have already been blessed will give to them as beggars. But these guys are no longer having food. But a prophet prophesied in the palace guys at the gate capture it you see you need to be a man of perception sensitivity to be able to carry some measure of glory they say if we sit here we'll die your problem is that you want to sit where you are be careful don't sit where you are And they said, go home. Put the next verse. Let's rush it. If we say we will enter into the city, then the famine is in the city. And we shall die there. And if we sit here, we shall die also. Now therefore, come and let us fall into the host of Syrians. If they save us alive, we shall live. And if they kill us, we shall die. They knew there was no food in Samaria. If we go inside, we are going to die. If we sit here, we are going to die. That is how to move in life. No retreat, no surrender. I'm not going back. I'm not going back. No matter how the economy is bad, the lion will not eat grass. The lion will never eat grass. No matter how the economy is bad, the lion will not eat grass. He said, The children of the king of the lion will not beg. Hear me. No matter how the economy of Nigeria is, you are a lion and a lioness. You will not eat grass. I say you will not eat grass. You will not eat grass. Hey, Ebenezer, my stone of help, my stone of help, my stone of help, my help coming, my help coming, my help coming, my help coming. When your season change, your men will change. <laughs> when God changes your season, He changes your menu. Gada gada gada. From a dung, a dove dung.
on the donkey head. The menu is about to change. You have to differentiate your future from food. Some people have eaten their future as food. Don't boil your child and eat that is supposed to preserve your future. We no longer live for food, we live for future. When your future become your food, your appetite, your anorexia will rise up, you will be motivated and not be demotivated. Some of us are gallantly standing, ruggedly in the midst of storm because our future has become the motivator of why our mobility is unobstructable. Your future is your seed, your future is your profits. When your season start moving, your change have started. You are not next in line. You are now in line for a miracle. I say you are not next in line. You are now in line for a miracle. Oh, it's not for everybody there. Am I talking to those ones there? If you believe that you are the one I'm prophesying to, hmm? shout that amen well like thunder. If that amen is louder, a miracle is coming. Can I talk to somebody here? God is not using you because you are perfect. God is using you because you are present. The four lepers were not perfect, but they were present. I might not be perfect. I might be a leper, but if I'm present at the points to be used, I cannot be useless when I'm usable. There are people that are not leper, but they are not present. But if a leper, four lepers were present for God's move and God used them not because they were perfect. Go shadabakoto bakata. Am I talking to somebody here? God is not using you because you are able, He's using you because you are available. Availability is greater than ability. Available ability is greater than ability that is not available. You are too gifted but your gifted your giftings is not usable there was crisis in Israel farming let me say this before I round up what do you do when there is crisis number one you make a choice like the four lepers it is choice that separate men your choices will create your chances. Number two, what do you do in crisis? You use disadvantage for your advantage. Whenever there's crisis in disadvantage, there is advantage. Number three, when you have crisis, you surround yourself with men with positive vibes. Men would think positively. Right people, surround yourself with the right men. Number four, you think positively and you take positive step. Stop thinking negatively. Don't allow your season to control your reasoning. Don't allow your season to control your reason. Any vision you don't put to action will be put on auction. Any vision you don't put to action will be put on auction. Hear me very well. They took steps. Now, 
Yeah. It's not for everybody. As they started taking step. When you read down, you see they took their step at twin lights. Let's read it. I need you to see this. My God. God is powerful. God will make your foolish step to become a giant step. Put the next verse. Let's go. And they rose up in twin light. Underline twin light. To go up to the camp of the Syrians. And when they were come to the uttermost part of the camp of the Syria. Behold. There was no man. Twin light. It's early in the morning before sunrise. Hear me. To wake up very early. Before the sunrise. Before your enemies think of waking up. My God would have rise up for you. Hey! Before they wake up in the morning. Before they think of jumping up. Those of you here, am I prophesying? Before they think of jumping up. My God will rise up for you. My God will rise up for you. Am I prophesying? Before they think of rising up, my God will silence them. Those of you on the gallery, before they think of rising up, my God will rise up. Those of you here, before they wake up, your miracle have started. Hey, if you believe that, jump up and shut fire. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Sit down, sit down. They got to the camp of the Syria. No man was there. Hey, what the army of Israel could not do, what the king could not do, four lepers who were not prophets, who were not pastors, they were not presents but they carry the prophecy by the spirit they capture because deep color to deeper it's not by the outward here but deep color to deep can I chip this in your body does not know anything nothing your body dances to what you allow. Uh, let, let me tell you a secret. A woman was celebrating a birthday, dancing, excited, celebrating a birthday because what a body received at that time by virtue of her hearing and seeing was celebration in the midst of it the husband called her in to break the news of the death of her mother suddenly when i hear had the bad news a dancing step stop what you hear can change your song can change your dance block your ears from bad news and naysayer the reason why you cannot dance anymore is the negative talker that is taking away instead of talking because talkers are takers if you hear bad news they are taking away from you your joy whatever are pure whatever are holy whatever are righteous whatever are true think on them life is too short to allow yourself to be in depression for things that are infinitesimal. Anything you can't solve, leave it for God. Don't worry yourself. Ah! Since I knew, by virtue of experience, that when I leave it for God, I don't worry myself. The problem that worries me, they automatically solve themselves. When I see the trouble is too much, I remove myself. Hear me, if you don't remove yourself, you will die. Hear me, sir, ma, if you die, life will continue. 
My children, my children, my children. If you die, your children will learn the future of survivor. Don't kill yourself. They will survive. I'm telling you. They will become better. Yes. Yes. Love them. Help them. Anything you can't solve, explain to them. Leave it for God. I, I'm telling you. You carry life burden too much. Life is so short. Leave it well. Yes, it's so short. Look at it now. All of a sudden now you are 52, 53, 54. So many years ago you were saying I'm just 18. Look at you now. You are getting close. You think you are young but your bones is telling you you are no longer like that. You can no longer twist your leg the way you used to twist it. That's life. Problem we continue to be around. In this world, ye shall have many trouble. There is no day there will be no trouble. I am telling you, there is no day. Solve this problem now. Another one will come out. You have to learn to live in the midst of trouble as means there is no trouble. That is why I say you can sing the Lord's song in a strange land. Stop thinking that the environment will be perfect. If you are looking for that, you will never have one. You can still eat well in the midst of battle. You can take your wife out. You can eat in her in an eatery. You can buy good food and rejoice and tell yourself, honey, let us rejoice for the Lord has done great things. We will thank God for what He has done and what He has not done. We will trust God to do it, but we will refuse to sorrow because of one thing He has not done. I, I, I'm teaching you, I'm not just preaching what I am not practicing. I'm telling you my life. When you see me teach, I teach my life. You are waiting for perfect time. You will live 90 years and you will never see a perfect time. You are looking for good friends. You will walk through life and never see good friends. You might have only one or two. You will see betrayer. Rejoice in the midst of betrayer. Your betrayers are eating well, getting fresh. You are drying up. Who did this to you? If you hate me, no problem. Who cares? If 90% are double femi, my feet 10% here come back. Leave the 10% that hate you. Allow the 90%. Feel the your friends are better than your enemy. They that are with us are more than they that you are saying they are talking. How many people are they that are talking? Two people. In the midst of 100 people that love you. Say your story boku for everywhere. Where? It's a lie. Your story no boku. Now two people they gossip you. Mention that to people and walk away. Anybody that does not love you, you, you is a witch. Look at how fresh you are, like Titus fish, and somebody not go like you. That person is a pastor. Hey! Hey! Ay, 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 ay. Hey! Are you hearing me? Jump your mind. Jump up and shut fire. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey! Hey! Celebration! 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 Hey! Hey! Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey! Ja, la, 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 la. Hey! Ay, 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 ay! Come on! Hey! I'm taking over! 
The lie of the enemy is for you not to sing a new song in the midst of temptation. You will sing. You are going to sing a new song. As a matter of fact, the song has started. Hey! <laughs> What the enemy thought will kill you, it has made you better. Hey, what the enemy thought will swallow me, God has turned it around. What the enemy thought will make me cry, he has turned it around. They made it for evil, the Lord turned it around. They made it for evil, the Lord turned it around. Lift up your leg and shut fire. Hey! in crisis God will use four lepers who are handicapped who are not perfect who are not clean leprosy is a position and composition of impurity uncleanness but God used four lepers to save a whole nation when God wants to save you he will use the foolish things of this earth to confirm the wisdom of the wise let's read on let me show you something. See what happened. <laughs> For the Lord. I made the host. Of the Syrians. To hear the noise. Of chariots. I love this God. I love this God. Four of you come. Four. Yeah. Stand here. Stand You are not four lepers, you are four healers. So I'm using you people as the four healers. Bind your hands together. Now. Every step these four guys took, they heard it as chariots of oxes. As they took the first step. Serious, yeah? boom, 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 boom. You are the one thinking you are taking ordinary step. But in the camp of the enemy, 
is a ballistic missile. You are the one thinking you are praying for one minute. That one minute is shaking their kingdom. You don't need confirmation. You need affirmation. When you get there, God will affirm what he has said through your stand. You don't need to see it. Keep taking the step. As they took the step, take the first step. Bam. Serious. And the king, the head, go, 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 go. Chariot. Hey. He made the little thing I do be like saying a big feel. connection they said you came out from a poor background they said you are not articulative they said you are not educated they said you are not beautiful they say you are not a classical girl that you came from the village they said you are not sharp they said you are not correct but you have a faith in a God with the spirit of prophet and me and one will live have I not said it will I not do it there are two immutable things it is impossible for God to lie if he said it it will come to pass I don't know how it will but when they turn the captivity of Zion around we were like men that dream dream some trust in chariot some trust in horses but we remember the name of the Lord our God for the name of the Lord is a strong tower that when the righteous run in they are saved with men things are impossible with God all things all things all things all things are possible 
My daddy, my daddy. My daddy. Oh, he is singing. I was singing and shouting and shouting for the rest of the day. My daddy, my daddy. My daddy, my daddy. You are taking today is about to produce miracle. Now hear me, hear me. This sermon is not the normal sermon. The anniversary has started today. I, I'm telling you, this step of faith you have in your heart, God is about to move mountain. Hey, hey, hey! You have cried too much. God said I should tell you, clean your tears and stop crying. Take a step. Take a step. Take a step. Take a step. You know this song? I'm a soldier in the army of the Lord. I will answer a billion times. I'm a soldier in the battlefield, waiting to hear the voice of my commander. Oh, Jesus, if you call my name, I will answer a billion times. Hey! Who is calling my name? Oh, Jesus is calling my name. Jesus, oh, Jesus, if you call my name, I will answer a billion times. Who is calling my name? Oh. Jesus is calling my name. Oh. Jesus, oh, Jesus, if you call my name, I will answer a billion times. I am a soldier. I am a soldier. I'm about to sing, waiting to hear the voice of my commander. Oh. Jesus, if you call my name, I will answer a billion times. Hey! Jesus is calling my name. Jesus, if you call my name, I will answer a billion times. Hear me, hear me, hear me. The researchers in this end time are not pastors. I'm not the one with title. I'm not the way I'm bearing at bishop. They can be like the four lepers. Mr. No Man. Mr. No Name. They don't carry title. They are ordinary. They are not around to prove that they pray 20 hours. But their little step in the secret make an open. God is raising an army. Not with title. Not with attack. Not with critical man. But a secret army that are not known. They might not be on television. They are like the four lepers. They are secret women, secret men, men of passion, men of fire. Hey! Take the step again. Take it 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 again. Now hear me. For every step you take, the enemy is running away from what they took from you. They are running. They are running. They are running. They are leaving what they took from you. Hey, I hear the Syrian armies are running. Let me read that scripture before we pray. Put it again. They hear, they heard the noise of chariot of horses we are going to pray now and you are going to pray he said for the Lord had made the Lord will make today 
he will make today. <laughs> the enemies, your Syrians, your people, your attackers, the villagers, the Winchester, the necromancer, the soothsayer, the familiar spirit, the attackers, the criticizers, the zoom zoomings, the Asian archives, the lords of heavens, the principalities, and Asian archives, the powers that fight you, start this as I don't know who they are. They shall hear the noise of chariots of horses. When they hear the noise of chariots of horses, angels are appearing. Now hear me again. He said, he said, even the noise of great host. Great hosts, they are not ordinary angels. They are seraphims and cherubims. <laughs> <laughs> and they said one to another no the king of Israel has had has had hired against all the kings of Hittites the kings of the Egyptians hey. they said the guys coming are not lepers they are kings they thought you are a leper but your step is a step of a queen and a king. <laughs> they themselves are saying, the king of Israel, hired kings. So the four lepers were in the category of kings. They were not lepers. When you begin to take step, you graduate from a leper to a king. Because this action can only be done by a king and not a slave. When you confront, you move from a slave. In the, not, not what we have these days. Where presidents are sitting in their presidential villa. And soldiers are going to the battlefield. In those days, if you are a king, you are the one that will be at the front. All your generals and lieutenants will stay behind you. If you are not a fighter, you are not qualified to be a king. You don't push generals at the front and you stay in the AC and be collecting AC and say, what is going on? Give me situational report. Mm -mm. Those days, you are at the battlefield getting situational report by yourself. And all the generals will be behind you. You will be at the front. You are the one that will first strike and all of them will follow you. We don't have generals today. We have AC generals. Church is quiet. When I hear somebody say I'm a retired prophet, you are confessing defeat. Me, I cannot retire. The day I will retire is when he takes me home. Me, I cannot retire. When angels are still fighting, demons are not retired. Me, I should retire. Even though I have to work with stick, I will preach with stick. I cannot retire. I saw Paagin. Paagin at that old age was still displaying the anointing. His legs were shaking and they were supporting him. I will not retire. I will refire. I will see my generation preaching in front of me and I will support them. If I have to sit down to preach, I will sit down to preach. That is why I salute Papa Deboye on the chair. Papa is still preaching. He's still ministering the word. That is how to see generals. It's not by talking. It's by action. You know, you know the body of Christ, we have not seen the move of God. When Papa Deboye said he went somewhere and he spoke the word for the, for the climatic environment to change. I see Nigeria boiling over a real testimony from a general. What will make a man at that start to slide? He has seen it all. He has entered the ring. He's all over the world. He is a voice. What, what do you think? Is why do we why have we diminished God? 
that he can't do anything. Ah! May I not get to a level where scientific education takes the glory of God from me. If you don't believe him, we believe him. We have seen signs and wonders. I am the man that the Lord has given me. We are made for sign and wonder. When I hear people say, come and prophesy over Nigeria. You don't know what is keeping Nigeria is prayer. Go and check. There is no country that have gone through what Nigeria has gone through that have survived it. With what is going on now, what is keeping Nigeria? It's not soldiers, not military. It's the hand of Jehovah. With the rise of dollar, with the pressure of the economy, hey, sir, ma, leaders, it's not your intelligence. What is keeping Nigeria is a strange hand. The people are provoked. The masses are tired. But yet, they are following. It's God's hand. Are you ready? All of them ran out. Four lepers, they came into the... Ah, ah, yeah, yeah. You will not draw any sword. You will win battles. God said to me, one day I was angry over something that happened. And I want to take a step. And God said to me, if you put your hand, it's no longer my battle, it's your battle. I remove my hands. When God fights your battle, he doesn't need your contribution. Yahweh way is the holy way. Mm. Hear me? When it is Yahweh way, no any other way. When God fights your battle, your fasting, he doesn't need your fasting. He doesn't need your prayer. When he fights your battle, it is when you are sleeping. Somebody said this story and I believe it. He said, one day, Brother Moon, Told son that don't you see darkness all around here? And brother son say, I don't see any darkness. And brother moon say, it's because you have not come to where I am. That is why you are not seeing darkness. Then brother moon say, brother son say, point the place where there is darkness so that I can go there. So brother moon point to brother son that area. There is darkness. Brother son went there and said, I see no darkness. Then brother moon discovered that. Brother son don't need to shine in the midst of darkness. Anywhere he enter, light shine. Can I prophesy? Anywhere you enter, poverty disappear. Anywhere you enter, light shine. You will not experience darkness again. You are a career of light. Career of light. Career of light. 300 of you that are light bearer. Career of light. Shine. 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 